votes will lead to Omolokombashi in the Umasati region for the commemoration of Yero's Day on August 26. Swapu Party Secretary General Nangolo Mbumba made this announcement during a media briefing in the capital on Tuesday. Nampa spoke to the governor of that region on the importance of the Omasati region's role during the liberation struggle. But you should understand also that the liberation struggle of Namibia was engaged by the sons and daughters within the territory of Namibia, by then Southwest Africa. Now, when you narrow down to Omusati, one thing you must understand is that the Omuluombashi where the first bullet was fired is in Omusati region. That base that made a clarion call is in Omusati region. The governor added the founding father and former president, Dr. Sam Nyoma, hails from that region. But you must also understand, and I do not want to own the founding father, is also a son of a Musati region. But it is a leader of the Republic of Namibia, the first president. It is a commander of the People's Liberation Army of Namibia. It is a son of the soil of the Republic of Namibia and a grandson of the territory of Africa. As per tradition, President Ifeke Punyepohamba is expected to deliver the keynote address during the event, which is recognized by the United Nations as Namibia Day. This day was designated as such because it was on August 26, 1966, when colonial South African troops attacked the Swapo military base at Omolokombashe, forcing pioneer fighters to fight heroically to repel the attack.